What up, guys? With the Agave guys, I'm Manny. This is Lopi. And today we are gonna review our favorite tequila made from a celebrity. Let's get into it. And today we are reviewing El Tesoro de Chuy Chavez. Slopey, do you have anything to say to these beautiful people? Oh, of course. We are five. Yes, count. One, two, three, four, five. Five subscribers from 100 subscribers. Landmark achievement for us. We didn't think we'd even get anywhere close to this. But, you know, up and up is all that we can look forward to. But to assist us getting to that five additional subscribers, hit that subscribe button. Smash the subscribe button. Smash the like button. Comment down below what you want to see next. <laughs> yes, before Lopi brings down the bar. Smash! <laughs> so let me tell you a little about this product. Um, it is from Chewy Chavez. He's um, a singer of a band, band member from Los Originales de San Juan. Mm -hmm. uh, put music, hopefully we don't incorporate it. video now uh, so uh, they make it in Nome 1443 uh, they make it in San Ignacio it's a phenomenal tequila and in my opinion it's probably um if not the best one of the best um, celebrity tequila it's a Mexican celebrity still a celebrity in my book uh, let's get into it Lopi all right so let's take a look at this fine looking bottle uh, generic bottle, clean logo, can't complain. Yeah. Um, it's not available in the States right now. They're working on it. Mm -hmm. They say it's going to retail for, to, um, for 45 bucks. Oh, decent. Yeah. So, solid bottle, solid mm -hmm. price. Can't complain about that. Yeah, it's got a cool cowboy in the back. It's probably Chewy. Yeah. Uh, I believe that's Chewy Jr. Chewy Jr. Uh, it's pretty cool. I like the logo. It's, it's uh, clean. It's like the color. Uh, kind of metallic. Uh, chrome, so yeah, I can see that. Good bottle. So, I mean, let's uh get into the important stuff. The aroma. Reminder: It's forty-five bucks. If it does come to the states, it, it will. Should. It's it um, should, coming. Yes. Um, first, it's gonna be in California, in Illinois, and then you know it spreads like a like a virus. <laughs> Interesting one. Alrighty. Well, to start off with the aroma, Lopi. I'm getting hints of flower, like daisies and stuff. So like pollen? No, I'm not a bee. So, I don't know what pollen smells like. <laughs> like a like a flower metal. I'm getting flowers, hints of vanilla. Agave. I'm not getting agave this time. Maybe you are, but um, maybe Lopi is the <coughs> <laughs> I haven't even drank yet. Bit of alcohol. Yeah. Just mm -hmm. a bit. It's strong smelling. I will say that. I think it's like, uh, I'm getting flowers, hint of vanilla, just very little, mm -hmm. and a hint of alcohol. Lopi's getting agave. Um, let's get into the taste, Lopi. Salute. Salute. This is a 38% um, alcohol one. I tasted the 41, it's about the same. Um, the 40 is gonna be available in the United States, Mexico, you know. Okay. We like it a little more smooth so we can drink more. Salud. Salud. Very smooth. Lopi took a giant sip of that. I'm getting almond, vanilla, and a bit of like flour like uh, the plant not like the why well, do you know what flour tastes like i don't know well, i got hungry one time <laughs> it's eating flour. daisies out there yeah. you're just cutting you know, eating your own grass yeah. 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 if the cows can eat it i can eat it right you guys know what my meat well my meat eats so solid 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 smooth you know no no bs no uh it tastes like caramel no it tastes like um almond almond right a lot like nut Good kind of nut. 
It's kind of like um, the Don Julio Real, the spinning one. Mm -hmm. That one tastes like nut, like nuts. This one tastes like almond. Yeah, it's like the almond, specific almond. almond. <laughs> Which I enjoy, you know, not a lot of tequila tastes like almond. Let me get another sip of it. Warmth in my chest. It's phenomenal for like a cold day. Yeah. Drink this, you warm up. Oh yeah, yeah. Um, not too much burning. For me, I don't know about Lopi Lopi, I'm assuming. Average amount of burning, actually. Um, it's not the worst I've ever But yeah, almond. A lot, a lot of hints of almond. I did have this also, because I've been drinking it for a while. Because I, I like to try it before we do the shoot the video. So, uh, I tried it in a Paloma. Phenomenal. The taste of almond really hint, uh, elevates the cocktail. Mm -hmm. And I had it in a margarita. Top notch too. Really? So, highly recommended for mixing too. Oh. Top, top notch. Okay. But the almond taste is really good. Good for sipping too. Again, like uh, Lopi and I said, it's gonna retail for 45 bucks. Mm -hmm. um, not cheap, but not expensive, you know? I mean, no offense, but this is like one of the more cheaper things we've reviewed yeah, so far. But for Blanco, it's not cheap. Oh, okay. Uh, but uh, FYI to everybody, um, tequila prices are gonna sh be shooting up. The price of agave keeps going up. So if you get, if you buy like a twenty dollar tequila, they probably bought pinas back from like two thousand twelve when it was like eight pesos a kilo. Now it's like thirty four pesos a kilo for agave. Stocks with many. <laughs> but uh, yeah, okay. let's get into the review, Lopi. So let's um, start off with um, the look. Mm -hmm. Um. Simplistic. Simple, clean. Chewy Jr. on the bag. Was Chewy it the Jr., bio? yeah. Agave. Mm -hmm. um, trees. Trees, the name, logo. I'm gonna give this um, a 7 out of 10. It's nothing special, but it's clean, simple, mm -hmm. and it gets the job done. Oh, I know it's tequila, good. and I know. Making the mother of all omelets here, Jack. Can't spread over every egg. Good to go. Now let's move on to the price, Lopi. Like we said, bucks. 45 bucks. That is, um, you competing with Don Julio, Patron, and uh, those kind of tequilas. I like this. This mm -hmm. is probably one I would recommend everybody to get, like mm -hmm. for maybe like a weekly stuff or daily, like zipper. Because mm -hmm. I mean, it's 40 bucks. You're not breaking the bank, no. but you're not, you gotta think about it, you know, 45 bucks. So, but I recommend it um, for saying that, I think 8 out of 10 is fair to say. Yeah, I would say that's pretty reasonable. Um, I'd probably step it down to maybe a 7 price wise for me, but it's about that range. It's, it's pretty decent for 45 bucks, I'd say that. So let's go ahead and move into the taste. The taste. So the taste is very unique. Almonds. That's like, if you get anything from the video, almonds. If you like almonds, A1 for you. I want to take a pic with Cardi B inside my cardigan um i love almonds actually they're expensive though. um saying that there's hints of flour for me and no hints of vanilla which is interesting because usually plata you know it's uh, oh, vanilla and all that crap but no saying all that i'm gonna give it a eight out of ten solid smooth very very warm i would like to say very yes. very warm it's like i'm getting hugged by like a snuggie in my throat yep throat uh, right down the throat and right into your chest. yeah but it's a smooth warm which is kind of weird because you like when you're when you think like if it's burning like that's like rough like but no cinnamon, it's a, like yeah. cinnamon burning it's yeah like but it, it's a very smooth burn like imagine putting a heated blanket on your exactly. chest exactly down your throat don't choke um but saying all that um i don't know if i said it uh, uh eight out of ten for me yeah, I would have to be about the same ballpark, maybe 7.57. 7. Uh, pretty decent, you know, for 45 bucks. That's a yeah, pretty good, decent, yeah, decent taste for 45 bucks. Okay, with the final review, saying everything, oh. um, price is A, not A1, decent. Mm -hmm. Bottles, decent. Mm -hmm. Price, I mean, the best thing out of this is probably the taste, in my opinion. Mm -hmm. Saying all that, um, it's a solid drinker, you know, a good sipper, good mixer. I'm gonna give it an 8 out of 10. Thus, I don't hate it. I like it a lot, so 8 out of 10, I highly recommend everybody to, if you see it in the shelf, yeah. pick it up, try it out, you know, it's a top notch tequila. Yeah, just keep your eyes out for any uh, liquor stores, you might find it and snag it, yeah, be a good deal, 45 bucks, decent taste, almonds, you know, nice warmth, mm, yeah, warm. Um, 
I'd have to give it an 8 as well. Well, that was our review for uh, the Soto the Chewy Chavez um, thumbs up. Well, um, thank you again for watching and for those who stay at the end of the video. Um, we appreciate it. We're gonna keep shooting reviews. We're gonna try to do more tequila related so, like uh, reviews, but like we can what? Tequila prodigals. This stuff, this is We're just gonna try reviewing tequila. Let us know, like video ideas. Mm -hmm. uh, we're open to try. Mm -hmm. um, but mainly tequila stuff. So, well, did Lopi want to say anything or? If you made it to the end of the video, comment down below. Ah! But other than that, have a fantastic day. Yeah, well, this is Manny. This is Lopi. Ciao. Ciao.